you are very, very welcome back again. Round four of the 2020, 2021 and 2022 EOS season from Dawn in Germany. This is four wheel drive, A main, leg number two. Guys are just doing their warm up laps, checking the cars for grip. And just to remind you, that in leg one, it was Michael, Lors or Michael Orlowski who pretty much checked out, leaving oh, Yuna and Jorn to battle for second. So, Michael has dominated. An, an amazing performance. Just as the drivers are announced. And everybody is ready. Okay, let's see what Michael can do. Can he sew it up in two? Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four. Michael is away. Clean start. Bartos second. Yuna third. No problems for anybody at the start, unlike leg one. Now, can't think of the last time that an A main was a Polish 1 2 at the front, but here we go. Pole in first, pole in second at the moment. Now, bar toss through. Ah, well, what happened there? So, Michael, Michael touched the track marking, went wide, bar toss in the between side, but then bar toss went quite wide on the next corner. Let Michael back in. And there is the mistake from bar toss. Under jumped, got the chassis slap and bounce wide. So now we have Michael leading, Yuna second. Michael hasn't had a chance to get away, so Yuna can apply pressure. Maybe make a move stick. Let's see what happens. So I'll try and give you the order. Michael Orlowski first. Yuna Hatton second. Bartos Solowski is third. Pekka Ivan in fourth, Jorn in fifth. And Yuna tags, ah, Yuna tags Michael and there's jumps off the track. And now Bartos is gone, well this is messy. So, let's try and pick up here. Do Michael in the lead. Then we have Pekka Ivan in second, and Jorn now in third, and Yuna recovering to fourth. But I can tell you something is that Michael Olasky is not checking out this time the way he did last time. Maybe he'll get the camera down at this stage now that everything's settled down. You can see that Michael and Pekka are starting to gap. Yuna, who is now in third. Michael, Pecco, Yuna, Jorn, Lee Martin. And now the two front men are starting to check out. It is Michael Lassie and Pecco Ivanen with the Schumacher. Both men with Schumachers. And they really have put the hammer down. They are making... The gap is increasing back to third in a noticeable way every night. So can Pecco get close enough to make a move on Michael? And then you have to wonder how well that will go down. 
internally within the Schumacher camp. Maybe Pecco's happy to sit there, but as a racer myself, I know I'd much rather have the win and cause problems in the camp than come second. So, just listen out to Uwe now and try and get an idea of how much time is left. I would say it's coming up to about one minute left. So we've got Michael Orlowski in the lead, Pecco, Ivan and it's just behind them. Luna is in third. All it will take is a little, the littlest of mistakes from Michael Orlowski and Pecco will be through. But on that lap, Pecco has had a few bobbles and has given Michael the tiniest bit of time. So about 30 seconds to go now. There we go, the 30 second buzzer. I don't see Pecco being able to pull up to the back of Michael. We'll just keep our eye open for an error. Looks like Michael is going to get through for the final lap. I'll try and pick up now and see who is in third place, it's Yuna and Yorn. So I can see out of the corner of my eye that Pecco has relaxed and Michael has broken away and will take the win now. Pecco second, Yuna is third, and the drag race for fourth is Lee Martin, Misha Widmeyer. Well, there you have it. So Orlowski takes the meeting with two wins. That's four wheel drive wrapped up. Completely dominant performance. Pretty incredible. Nobody was fit to touch him, although Pecco looked pretty close. Pretty good performance. I'm gonna try and get some photos of Pecco's car. I know it's a lot of guys in the top, the top of the A-Final who don't want their cars photographed uh, for, for whatever reason. So, um, Pecco might, might give us a look. We'll go and, and see if he will. All right, thanks for watching. Uh, as I said before, there is a like and subscribe button. You don't have to hit it if you don't want to, but uh, every little helps, as that old lady in Tesco's used to say. Uh, come back to us for leg three later on. Thanks. Bye.